In Oakland now, the police and fire department are trying something new with their 911 calls. It's a pilot program to ease the burden of all those calls coming in. Yeah, it's called MACRO. That stands for Mobile Assistance Community Responders of Oakland. And right now they've gone through months of training, building relationships with people in Oakland so they can better serve them. Our Justin Andrews went with the MACRO team to see exactly what they do out there. And Justin, it's already making quite the difference. Yeah, it is. What they do is way more than just what a normal EMT does on the streets. They literally canvass the streets of Oakland, running into people who distrust hospitals, don't have access to them, or have unmedicated metal, mental health issues. Macro steps in and brings, them, brings that service to them. I met one guy who desperately needs this. For seven years, Eric Hale has been living here on the streets in East Oakland. I don't even know how it feels to be inside anymore. That's because outside is home for him, his wheelchair, his place of comfort. A few months ago, he got a spider bite and it laid eggs infecting his leg badly. If they wasn't here to do this, man, I probably would lose my leg. That's where Jazare Armas comes in. We run into people with infected wounds that have gone unaddressed. She's a macro responder and EMT. Growing up in Oakland, she's experienced some things, even felt helpless. So now she's doing what she can to be the person she needed back then. It's also given me a purpose to give back to the community because the community has given so much to me. Macro, I mentioned it earlier. It stands for Mobile Assistance Community Responders of Oakland. It's a pilot program now, but eventually this team will respond to nonviolent, non-emergency 911 calls, all to meet the needs of the community and to one day free up the emergency service system. Macro 4 will show you in service. Joshua Hayes is Jazare's partner. He says the last nine weeks of this has been focused on community engagement and letting people know Macro is here to assist them. The need will be different call to call, but what we're seeing an overwhelming amount of is a need for interaction and care and empathy. Their interaction is different and comes from the heart. We have people coming up to us all the time saying, thank you for being here. Thank you. Thank yous from people like Eric. I need them. I really need them. I let them know, too. Knowing if these macro EMTs weren't here. All right. Ow, man. A spider, a little spider, man. He says he may not have been here either. And we can tell from that story that macro services are so essential, especially for that area, because there are so many people out there like Eric who needs those compassionate services brought directly to them. Again, this program is in the pilot stages right now, but there are plans for this to fully launch. We know San Francisco launched a similar program about a year and a half ago. Amanda.